Greetings everybody, my name is Captain Jolan Zeke and welcome back to another Challenge Rift. Challenge Rift Journal 30 for North America and we have the Shadows Mantle Impale Demon Hunter. We got Carlyce Point, we got Holy Point Shot, we got the full set and we got the Dawn in the Cube. Alright, what I want you to do is use Force Move and Force Standstill. Why those two? Like... Force move will give you the ability to just run around and you don't have to click. Like, I'm not clicking anywhere and I'm moving. Force move is to be able to activate your bolas without having a monster near you. Right, so what I want you to do is activate your vengeance. And then press your impale. Do not overuse your impale. Only, try to only use it on elites. If you're out of hatred, use your bolas to regain it, and then you can just go back to Impale. You can use Vault to dash around the map, but beware your discipline drops. It's only at 30 and it will drop. Alright guys, without further ado, let's get into the rift. Alright guys, here we go. Challenge rift, 330 for North America. So we are up on the Desolate Sands. Again, activate your Vengeance. Activate your Shadow Power. And all you have to do is like spam your impale. Right, we come across a yellow and an instant shield pylon. That shield pylon is gonna last for, for at least this entire floor. So, we click on the shield pylon, we kill the yellow over there. We come to this spot, we kill another yellow, we, kill, we grab the channeling pylon, and then you just go forward. All right, you come down to the, the right side of the map and you find the yellow there. Again, your impale will demolish everything in one go. Everything is gone. All right, here we come across another yellow. Make a quick of him and keep going down. Don't go to the exit. No, no, keep going down. The reason why there's like an elite down in the bottom right corner. And you want to have them as well to have a very good time on this floor. All right. You make quick work of that blue, and now you're going to walk up to the exit, but you will leave the exit to the right. You will find this little blue pack over here. You make quick work of them. Now your shield pylon should also be like worked out, and your channel pylon will also be gone. Right. Going to the next floor, the silver spider. It's an easy one. Big booty spiders. Come instantly a blue. Again, you can shoot your impale from quite a distance away and they will get demolished. All right, we go into the bridges here and then we go to the yellow, cross the bridge. Across the bridge, you will find a condi pylon, which you're gonna use for at least a certain 20 seconds. Make quick work of the blue. Your condi is gonna zap everything around you. And basically all you have to do is like walk forward. Use your force move, use your force stand still and you will be good. All right, this, this blue, it's double blue. I had a little leg spike over here. I, I'm sorry for that. All right, here we come across the final blue for this floor. And all you have to do is like, just keep shooting your impale until you hit 100%. Who do we spawn? We spawn Infernal Maiden. All you have to say to Infernal Maiden is see you next week, dude. All right, guys. So you just saw me clear Challenge Rift. It's pretty easy. It's pretty straightforward. Once again, you have a full build, so you, you're good to go. All right, guys. Thank you all for watching. Have a good one. Stay healthy and catch you all in the next one. Bye-bye.